Since the 1930s, Clare County kids had 4-H, FFA, and the Junior Farm Bureau as organizations to help teach them about agriculture. But the FFA chapter at Clare High School became non-active in 2002, leaving a void between 4-H and MFB Young Farmers for students like Kyle Shunk. To fill the void, a group of students made a proposal to the Clare County Farm Bureau to create a group interested in learning about agriculture. Our official name is called the Jack Pine Farmers and Ranchers and it really relates to anything as far as ag and farming. We uh, tour farms and anything to do with agriculture really. I mean, we first trip we took was a bee farm, second was like a dairy farm. We went to the Ag Expo and we'll probably visit like a meat packing place next and talk with financial companies too, somewhere in there, as far as you know, how to get going with the farm. They weren't 18, they could not be a, a full member themselves, but were very interested in, in becoming involved with Farm Bureau and to find out more information about careers, potential careers for their future. I went to a, to a county meeting and there were about 10 or 12 of them there. You know, indicated to them that if their parents were members, they could certainly be affiliated with Farm Bureau, but we have no formal program. The Jack Pine Farmers and Ranchers have grown to 16 members ages 10 to 16 from Clare and Gladwin counties. They meet monthly, donning their trademark plaid shirts to have a bit of fun before getting down to the business of farming. There's so many things to learn about how to do business, not necessarily driving the tractors all the time. It's more of, it's on the paper. It's, uh, that's what we've been learning. Uh, I chose to do it because I'm a farmer and I want to continue on with farming. Uh, I want to get out of it as much as possible. I mean, there's so many opportunities out there. I just want to uh, experience them all. Well, to me, it tells me that these men and women have a real interest in agriculture and they're not going to be deterred by any age limit. They're going to go out and they're going to get into it. Uh, they just work hard, they enjoy going, and when you can get 10 teenage boys to act like adults on different programs with no horses around, I, I think that says a lot about them. We've had a number of years that uh, we've had young people like this, you know, these the uh, jack pine uh, farmers and ranchers uh, that wanted to be involved, but there just wasn't anything for them to go, so when the opportunity came about, uh, these young people put the thing together and uh, really all we do is just stand back and kind of watch them from the side, make sure they're doing okay. We have a hard time getting young farmers in our group because most of them won't go off to college and then they don't come back. These are boys who want to stay farming and so it's a good future, I believe, for our area to have a bunch of young men and women who are going to be interested in taking over Farm Bureau for their support of the formation and growth of the Jack Pine Farmers and Ranchers, the Clare County Farm Bureau receives the 2012 Michigan Farm Bureau Counties Activities of Excellence Award.